Hi guys, in this video, I'll be comparing Monday.com and Notion, the two popular productivity tools that offer a wide range of features for project management, task management, note taking, and knowledge management. However, there are some key differences between the two platforms that may make one a better fit for you than the other, so let's get started. Monday.com is generally considered to be more user friendly than Notion, with a more intuitive interface and easier to learn features. Notion, on the other hand, can be a bit more complex to use, especially for users who are new to productivity tools. However, Notion also offers high degree of customization, which can be appealing to users who want to create a workspace that is perfectly tailored to their needs. Both Monday.com and Notion offer a wide range of features, but Monday.com is more focused on project management, while Notion is more focused on note-taking and knowledge management. Monday.com offers features such as task boards, Gantt charts, and Kanban boards. Notion offers features such as databases, wikis, and calendars. Also, Monday.com has a wider library of templates than Notion, covering a wider range of use cases. Notion's template library is smaller, but it still includes a good selection of templates for common tasks. Both Monday.com and Notion offer integrations with a variety of other tools, but Monday.com has a wider range of integrations available. Monday.com integrates with popular project management tools like Jira and Asana, as well as design tools like Figma and Sketch. Notion also integrates with a variety of tools, but its integration list is not as extensive as Monday.com's. And for the pricing, Monday.com and Notion offer similar pricing plans, with both tools offering free plans for individual users. Monday.com's pricing tiers include the free plan at no cost, the basic plan at $8 per user per month, the standard plan at $10 per user per month, the pro plan at $16 per user per month, and for the enterprise plan, you'll need to contact sales. Similarly, Notion also offers four plans. The free plan costs zero, providing accessibility for those just getting started, for individuals needing more features, the Plus plan is available at $8 per month. Businesses can opt for their specific plan, which costs $15 per member per month, and for larger corporations with unique requirements, there's an enterprise plan with custom pricing. So, which productivity tool is right for you? Monday.com and Notion are both excellent tools, but they have different strengths and weaknesses. If you're looking for a tool that's easy to use and has a wide range of features for project management, then Monday.com is a good choice. Monday.com is also a good choice for teams that need to collaborate on a variety of different projects, as it offers a wide range of integrations and other tools. If you're looking for a tool that's more flexible and customizable, and that is better suited for note-taking and knowledge management, then Notion is a good choice. Notion is also a good choice for users who are on a budget, as its paid plans are less expensive than Monday.com's. To get started, simply sign up using the first link provided in the video description. Thank you for considering this option. And there you have it, a comprehensive comparison between Monday.com and Notion. I hope you found this tutorial useful and learned something new. So if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up to show your appreciation. If you have any questions or need further assistance, please don't hesitate to comment below. I will do my best to respond to all comments and provide helpful answers. Thanks for watching, and take care!